All right, we all know the advice, eat your greens. So whether it's broccoli, Brussels sprouts, kale, vegetables are a vital part of a healthy lifestyle. There is one vegetable that is often overlooked and usually avoided, but it's very easy to find and harvest, and we're about to try some. <laughs> KDK meteorologist Felicia Woody tells us about the benefits of dandelions. It's probably growing in your front lawn right now. Love your dandelions. Dandelions first are one of the most nutritious plants on the planet. That's right, dandelions. They're not just a nuisance weed that makes us sneeze, especially this time of year. Now, the only reason we don't like dandelions is it's a cultural thing. It came from Madison Avenue telling us that our lawn should be a monoculture. Pittsburgh's garden guru, Doug Oster, loves to eat dandelions, from the leaves to the petals. Actually, every part of a wild dandelion is edible except for the seed head that we blow. Okay, this is my very first time ever trying a dandelion green, so let's try it. Yes, it was bitter, but that's how it's supposed to taste. It's that part of, is the acquired taste, that bitterness. And there's all sorts of ways to prepare them. And they're tender, a little bitter, but they pair well with like balsamic vinegar or with a red sauce. I like them on pizza. He also mentioned that they can be cooked into soups and burgers, but they're especially tasty when cooked in bacon grease. And it's very easy for you to find some of these greens on your own. Hack it to the ground after it's done flowering and whatever sprouts up, just take a little taste of the green and see if it's for you. So a great source of nutrition that also doesn't break the budget. Many uh, of us gardeners now are just are letting them do their thing uh, because they are such a positive for the environment and they are such a tasty treat. Now, some people who really know me will call me the world's pickiest eater, but I was actually pleasantly surprised. It really brave. wasn't as bad. Yes, I was very brave. It really wasn't as bad, but as you guys take a bite, you'll notice that it actually kind of tastes like you're just having a leaf from a salad. And it actually, I thought it tasted pretty good. The bitter does kind of add on to there. So yes, I brought some back for you guys. These were just picked a couple of hours ago. <laughs> I, Ken has been so excited kinda to bitter. try this. <laughs> Needs a little Italian dressing, but you know, yeah. mixed in with some other lettuces, it might be okay. Needs a, needs a pizza under it. <laughs> <laughs> Even better idea, I like yeah. that. Thank you though, super yeah. nice of you. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. plenty of these in my yard to find, so that's good, that's easy, exactly. they're free. Exactly, <laughs> it, it's budget friendly, so you can probably just go that's right true. out to your lawn, just rinse them off, clean them up, and then you're all good. And now Ray has to do three minutes of weather with a dandelion taste yeah. in his mouth. <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save the rest of this for later. Sure you are, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, we all are, yeah. And I'm gonna go do, do the weather right now. <laughs>